Hi and welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a quick speed paint just to show you the benefit of leaving large areas of negative space in your painting. Here it's this big field, it's just the white of the paper and suggests a very snowy field. Um, and also I want to say thank you so much to the people that have come and joined me on Patreon so far to support me and I've already posted quite a few um, tips and tricks videos there. So come and join me if you think it might be for you. There'll be a link below the video. Right, on to the painting. Um, quick speed paint really and I'll be using indigo, sepia, raw sienna and burnt sienna here. Just going to do a quick clean wash for the sky. Um, put in some distant trees, indication for a foreground which leaves out a gap for the field. I'm not going to paint the field at all except to put some distant trees in at the back in pale blue. As you can see it looks quite effective. Um, the field looks snowy, I mean it's a bit extreme, it could probably do with a little bit of dry brush in it or a little bit of texture but I think it shows you how useful negative space can be in creating um, those sorts of effects like snow. Um, just going to put some branches in, I'll finish off some details, get a nice strong contrast at the front and that in itself, that strong contrast um, really shows off the white of that field as does the contrast of the fence and all the shrubs and grasses along the edge of the fence. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this. Sorry it's a short video today, but I've had a bit of a busy weekend. Anyway, thank you very much. Please like and subscribe um, and take a look at my Patreon page. Anyway, I'll see you soon. Take care then. Bye.